Leave me alone, friend. Hello. Okay, well that's not working. Wait, can I throw things to distract it? I kind of want to try, but I don't trust the chair to fly far enough. I'm kind of glad it's completely blind and can't see my torch, though. second. Uh, there's four things there and only three light up. Oh, doesn't change anything. I saw the shadow of it, like, right behind me. No. I can feel it breathing down my neck. sneak away without it hearing me. Let's try. Okay, so if I'm actually sneaking, I don't think it can hear me at all. Yeah, these things are creepy as hell. Um... I honestly don't know why they're best to go. Like, like, we should probably be able to go down here if I find some bolt cutters or something. Maybe I don't even need to interact with whatever this machine is, but... Um... I feel like it... Oh, it probably would be able to hit me here. This area took you a long time to figure out. Alright. I bet it takes me even longer. I wouldn't mind not having a clue what to do. But not having a clue what to do and having to navigate around the uh, thing is... Um, Pretty feels bad. I'm gonna go see if I missed anything out here. I don't think I did. I looked around pretty well. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a door. Okay. Is that gonna zap me? No.
Oh, that smoke made me jump. Because it was movement. Why? We went down here. We got eaten. We're certainly not going back out there. Hmm. Can't interact with those. It still bothers me that the monster's smart enough to open doors. But I guess the game would be not very much fun if it couldn't, and you could just lock it in a room and wander around doing whatever you wished. Okay. We are going to go clockwise and inspect everything again. I already checked that room pretty thoroughly, so. Fuck it. Wait a second. Can I? I'm not sure what use this is going to be, but I'm curious to see something. Uh, wait. Where was it, though? Feels bad. <laughs> you can't blame me for trying, right? How are you doing, Seth? Oh, it's there. The submarine part was earlier. About to hit my bed so I can do reset rates. Ooh, nice. Is that seven hours from now? I'd like to do reset raids on a Monday morning again, but any time I've tried them in the last couple of months, bugs have been pretty bad. Bill's, Bill's an upset ray. Oh, you don't know if it's bad. You just test the waters and then, like... Alright. Ah, Wait, I don't remember this room. At all. Where the hell? How do we get here? Let me in. Monster can't get me in here. <laughs> Good night, Lola. I will catch you tomorrow. For the raids. safe in this area? What are we thinking, team? That 
sounds very close. Did you know gaming? The animation data for these monsters includes vent crawl animation that went unused. Oh! I'm glad it went unused. Although it would make the game more terrifying. How did it get here? If I had to crawl through a vent to get here. Did I miss a really obvious door? Like... I'm calling it it and not them. Is it technically wow? Or is, are you just saying there's more than one in this area? Which is probably correct. I'm just so used to, um, like Amnesia, right, there's only one place in the entire game, I believe, where there's more than one gatherer in, like, a small area, and that's the scripted bit where you die regardless. Um, until then you only see one at a time, so it could technically be the same one following you throughout the game. I know it's not lore-wise, but there is multiple instances of this wild Pokemon. All right. That answers my question. Thank you. I will be more cautious. Be nice if there was just one and I could lock it in a room and then just run away. No, you're right there, isn't it? Here it comes. Yep. Please don't walk around this corner. If you bump into me, I'm going to be a very sad boy. Good, 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 good. Let's go. I believe this is our destination. Ah, oh, a fisty blob. Give me that. Give me the health. <sighs> Sounds like it's moving quick. I wonder if using those attracts it. Hello friend. Nothing to see here. Nothing to hear. through that door, right? So... What did I come through this door? No, oh, I came through here. So I kind of need to follow where the monster's going. How very unfortunate. I'll wait for it to walk back past. I think we should give this one a name. Though. He's a, a little cutie. Stomping Steven, yes, I love it. Okay, perfect. That's not where I came out, right? Shuffle, shuffle. This is definitely a different air vent. Alright, we might be getting somewhere, team. 
Maybe. Wait, wrecked five. Have I really died five times since we started? Uh, four times since we started. That is creepy as hell. Just right there. I want to open the door. They're so loud. Please no more stomping, Steven. There's another one, isn't there? Of course there is. Of course. Please just walk past me, please, 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 please. I don't know how to get back here again. Come on. Okay, it's going back that way. I wish it had gone, like, down here, because then I could navigate it a bit better. At least it opened the door for me, though. That's nice. And it opened that door for me. Oh, he's being helpful. Let's see if he'll come back past me, though. Power failure. Recharge service battery. Okay, I think he's coming, team. Don't come down this corridor. No, 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 no. Mom, where's my charger? <laughs> Need to plug it in. Okay. If we just like walked back into the original area here, I would be so upset. I'm not gonna lie. But this I'm okay with. Yeah, that was my reaction. Uh. That's it, go that way. Go that way. Good boy. Please open this door. Yes! Honestly, I only noticed it because the prompt thing popped up. Oh, light open spaces, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Sploosh. Oh yeah, I'm, I can breathe underwater. Forgot about this. All right, good times. Having Donkey Kong Country a classic music. Okay. And I kind of want to look around down here, but I'm kind of not comfortable either.
This looks promising. I can't look down. It's annoying. Just like that. Hmm. He descends a lot. Quicker than he ascends, that's for sure. A lot slower, rather. Uh. Hello. Why do I go from here? Uh. Please don't hurt. Okay. Okay, cool. Awesome. Hmm. Please no... Please no spooks. Alright, a big lever. I like it. Emergency flush. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. How did one of them get here? Difference to the other pickle dude. Oh no. Ah! Oh. 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 Okay, this is scripted, it's okay. Let's <laughs> get the crap out of me though, I'm not gonna lie. So, oh, was there options? Like, what happened? What would happen if I'd walked towards him? I guess it would chase me into going down the other tunnel. Big red light. Fishies. Shiny fish. Are they mines? Alright. Let's find Omicron. Friend, this is a big ocean. Oh, they're not mines. Okay, that's good. this. Power failure. Okay. Let's follow the pipes.
just keep swimming. I see a white light. What is this? Oh, it's a blob. Okay. Don't need the blob right now. Am I actually gonna end up going around in circles? No, surely not. Oh, it's the end. Feels bad. Ooh, shiny. Following the pipes did not fail us, team. Probably only gonna play a little bit more before I head off. Do I want to turn these? I think we do. Blends in quite well with the wall as well. Before flushing, make sure to open valves and turn on the pump. But I cannot. We're gonna do it anyway. Oh. Pump. How do I do that? Ah. Hey, we did it, team. There's nothing in here. All right. This is interesting. That is slightly less interesting. I'm feeling reasonably safe in here right now. Maybe. Maybe. to Omicron, a smaller building connected to the main site. Can't you tell? No, my view is pretty limited. There's some heavy restrictions on my system access. Did you find a power suit? Not yet. I'm trying to figure out how to get into Omicron, the big building. Oh, okay. Keep up the good work. That's it? You got nothing? Good luck. <laughs> Thanks. Aw. Cat? How are you so okay with all this? With what? Being a talking box, for one thing. Not being human. That's not so bad. So, you're not bothered at all by not having a body? I'm getting there. You're making me feel really self-conscious. Come on, be serious. I never felt that comfortable being human in the first place. This isn't much worse. Not being able to move would freak me out. Glad you got the box and not me. Would make it a little easier to help out if I had a body, but you're doing a good job. Just figured being able to stretch a little would give you some ease. My physical constraints don't translate to my experience very well. I feel about as human as before, but as if suspended in air. Which is kind of interesting now that I think about it. 
Hmm, that is quite cool. <laughs> Good luck, Simon. Try not to die. Let's poke this. Any idea who this is? Not really. Not that familiar with the people at Omicron. Kath, why do you think I was made? Why would this AI, the WoW, bring me here? I don't think we could ever know. I have my own beliefs, but nothing that can be verified. Tell me, why do you think the WoW brought me here? The WoW had a range of assignments, but they all sprung from one single idea. Preserve humanity. When the comet hit the Earth, killing everything, leaving a fraction of humanity left alive, the WoW started to compensate. It's restoring humanity. I think so, but I don't think we share its definition of human. Or life, for that matter. <laughs> Catherine, are we alive? That's an impossible question to answer. We lack meaningful definitions. Just figure there must be a way to know. To know if this life is worth living. You assume you've changed so much, but have you really? I don't know. I don't feel so different. But the world sure does. I never realized how much the idea of myself depended on where I am. How do you mean? I miss Toronto. Not because my friends and family are there, but because I know where I fit in. In Toronto, I know who I am. That's an interesting observation. I mean, I'd be, uh... Probably more comfortable living in Toronto than um, Pathos 2, that's for sure. 